Hi Dress Air Cuties, Wayne here. Today we're going to draw a bunny holding a carrot. So let's get started. To draw this super cute bunny, let's first start by drawing a dumpling shape for the head. So I'm going to come right here and we're going to start with a curve for the top. And so this is my usual dumpling shape. It's going to be brown, looks like a little dumpling. And it's going to be narrower at the top and wider on the sides. So we're just going to start with this one big curve and I'm going to bring it down and widen it out on the sides. Uh, like that. So it's just one big curve and about right there we're going to start to bring it in. So this is kind of like where the cheeks would be. And let's just start bringing it in. And at the bottom it flattens out. So let's keep going back and forth. And with this bunny we're not going to close it up. We're just going to leave a little gap because we need to put a big carrot in there. But we just want to kind of end about the same level and about the same space. There's just a little opening right here. Okay, so now that we have that big curve in, let's come in here and bring this bunny to life. So let's say about right in this area, about here, I'm going to start with a circle for the eyes. So one big circle. And then I'm going to come right across, say about right here, and draw another circle. So my goal is just to make it about the same distance on both sides. There, so I have my two circles in. Then let's make them draw so cute. I says I'm drawing pretty big, I have enough room. But if you're at home and you're drawing small, you can just go ahead and just put one highlight in and then shade everything else in. But with the draw so cute eyes, you get to put color in the eyes. So that's why I like, <laughs> I like drawing my draw so cute eyes. And hopefully you do too. So now that we shade that in, let's come to the bottom and draw lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. There. Now my eyes in, I'm going to come above each eye and I'm just going to draw a soft curve over each eye. And then in between the eyes, let's draw a cute little nose. So let's say about right here. I'm just going to draw a soft curve and connect it in the center. There. Then from there, let's come straight down. About right here, we're just going to skip a little bit of space and then we're just going to draw out two curves on both sides. There. And then cap it off. Aww. <laughs> so this could be the start of any animal you want, right? But today we want to make it a bunny. So if you want to do that, just come up straight in the center where you need to draw these cute bunny ears. So about right here, I'm just going to go ahead in the middle, straight up and draw these cute bunny ears. I'm not going to make it too long, just short little ears and then draw another one right here, maybe off. A little angle. Or you can make them both straight up. It's all up to you. And then let's come in here. We're just going to draw the inside. And same thing here. There. Now we know it's a bunny, right? And if you like, you can come here and just add some whiskers on both sides. From there, let's uh, draw the body. So come right underneath the eye. So about right here, the center of your eye, we're just going to draw a curve. So we're going to start the arms. So about right here. So let's work on this side first. I'm going to bring this arm to about right here in this space because I want it to be touching our carrot. So I'm just going to draw this curve. Comes in to about right here. And then round it off and bring it in. There. Very cartoonish, right? So um, to make it a lot easier. So about right here, we're going to draw the same thing on the other side and bring it in. But with this side, we're just going to go all the way. 
because I know there's this one big carrot that the bunny's holding. So I'm just going to draw that shape right there. If you like, you can come in here, two little lines. There. And then let's come out about right here. We're going to draw the body and the leg. So we're going to start. So let's bring this down. Small little body. So I'm just going to bring this down. Not too tall. So say about right there and I'll just bring it in. Very simple little feet. So just bring it up. So same thing here. Just a curve at the bottom. And then we're just going to go ahead and connect it. We have a soft curve all the way across. <laughs> there. And then, of course, we need to add a tail. So we'll just put it right here. And then let's draw our carrot. So, like I said, on in this space right here, I'm going to turn my body so it's easier. We want our carrot angle this way. So just turn your paper or your body and we're going to go ahead and I want this carrot to be nice and big and touching this hand. So let's come right here. And so just imagine we want it at this angle. So say about right here. I have my point. Round it off. Nice big fat carrot. <laughs> and round it off and connect there. And then now we can come back up here and draw some leaves. So let's come here with one curve and then a taller one just to make it simple. And then come in here and just draw some lines. So some detail it gives our carrot some texture. Some long and short ones. There. Oh, so cute. Right? I hope you do think so and that it was easy for you to draw. And if you like, you can come right here. Just spruce it up with some grass. And of course, let's add a dandelion. So we're going to come up and draw a bunch of lines all around. Now one more. There. And that is pretty much it, except I forgot a heart, right? So um, where can we put our heart on this bunny? You know what, let's put it on our carrot. Would that make sense? No. <laughs> okay, let's just put it right here. <laughs> I should have thought about that. I totally forgot. I'm just going to put a heart right here to make it my draw so cute bunny holding a carrot. I really hope this inspires you and that I hope made it fun and easy for you to draw today. Thanks so much for watching. And if I helped you, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos. See you later.